This is the night both sets of supporters have been waiting for. Not long now until kickoff on match day one in the Champions League. Who will get off to a positive start with all three points? It's Everton. They face Porto. And the action comes your way next on EA TV Live. And welcome on a big night here at Goodison Park. I'm Derek Ray here on the commentary position, joined by Lee Dixon. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one. My goodness, so much to look forward to. It is Everton facing Porto. Yeah, it's very important. A goalkeeper on top of his game. Well, that's like the other end, the striker putting it in the net. The goalkeeper has to keep it out. And what a brilliant way to do it. And here's how Everton line up. Bernd Leno is the goalkeeper. Hector Bellerin starts with Luca Digne in the fullback positions. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. Will he play it in? Bayerin. Couldn't keep it. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. Alan, really good interception. Mateo Suribe. And do they mean business on this occasion? Oliveira must take the lead here. Oh, he's been denied. And they remain locked together. Well, the goalkeeper has earned his corn there. A fabulous save. Well, that's how to break the spirit of the attacker. And the measured ball from James Rodriguez. Can he put it away? Save, but still a chance. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Corner kick played in. Vital intervention. Well, we spent a bit of time with the manager ahead of kickoff. I think he was the most surprised to hear that it's his 50th game in charge today, Lee. Yeah, in the modern game, Derek, we're used to the chopping and changing of managers. So this is a significant milestone, but I'm sure secretly he'd love to cap it off with a positive result so he can go home and celebrate with his family. Sergio Oliveira, committed challenge. Well, that's how to blunt the edge of the opposing attack. They're certainly allowing their opponents to come on to them. Calvert Lewin. A deft clearance. Mateo Suribe. Well, that'll be a free kick. Uribe. Still level here but the pressure escalating. Going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. Harvard Lewin, this looks promising. Magnificent defending. What can they do from here? Wilson Manafa. Oh, they've lost it. That is that for the first half here. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. A 
What is Charleson? Calvert Lewin keeping it moving dynamically. And now Dominic Calvert Lewin. Well, possibilities inside the box. Digne. An opportunity to forge ahead from this corner situation. Well, the chance to take the lead, it really is. The crowd sends a goal. Well, no end product. Look at Digne. If you've picked up a newspaper this week, you'll doubtless have read a lot about James Rodriguez facing his former club. It was always going to be about him. And you've got to say, Lee, the reception has been pretty positive. Yeah, Derek, you're always a little nervous playing against your old team. You want to put a really good performance in, show the fans what they're missing. They do love him here, though, and he's had many a good performance in front of this crowd. And they haven't forgotten that. Godfrey. an interesting pass and he's clear as lines and now the delivery and it all counts for naught and we're inside the final 30 minutes making use of his physical strength to hang on to it What can he do from here? Wilson Manafa. Oliveira. He's got to score! Brilliant save by Bert Leno. Oh, it's fabulous. It really is. Position, everything. Everything right there. Let's just clarify the injury situation. Our man on the side of the pitch is Jeff Shreves. Oh, horrible injury to his shoulder there. Landed right on top of it. So... But he's tough, and I think he'll carry on. Cheers, Jeff. Look at Dinia. Alan. Moving the ball nicely, looking for that final pass. Hector Bellerin could cross it in here. And a throw-in it's going to be. James Rodriguez intercepting it intelligently well previously it was speculation but now 100% confirmed Bayern have got their man lead well he's been the obvious target for many clubs and you can see why he's a top player lots of people will love playing with this lad looking for that final pass looking for the goal that would put them ahead well read to win possession back now, counter-attacking possibilities here. On the attack, is there to be late drama? Alan. And now Bellerin. Great block. It has gone over the touchline for what'll be a throw-in. Here it is now, a substitution. From the bake. And intercepted it. Tony Martinez Otavio and the referee spotted the foul but has played advantage well read to ease the pressure inside the final two minutes of this contest still pushing for a winner Just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Richarlison. Now he must favour the cross. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. The final whistle is sounded, and both teams will have to be content with a draw here on match day one. Well, he can't really...
Just a couple of questions for you. Cheers, thanks. A long way to go this season, but a colossal match between first and second today that could play a pivotal role in the title race. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Hello, a warm welcome, and this is the scene here in North London. I'm Derek Ray here on the commentary position, joined by Lee Dixon. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Tottenham Hotspur facing Everton. Yeah, thanks as always, Derek. It's a pleasure to be here. Anticipating a really good game today. The atmosphere is great. Certainly buzzing from the spectators' point of view as we head towards kickoff. Hopefully, we won't be disappointed. And a Tottenham Hotspur free kick coming up. And the keeper takes charge and dealing with the free kick. Richarlison. I can tell you, a goal has been scored at Old Trafford. Who has scored that goal? Alan McAdany. It's a goal from Manchester City. It's been scored by Raheem Sterling. The keeper did well to narrow the angle, but he found the back of the net with a fantastically aimed shot. Eight minutes played, 1-0. Cheers again, Alan. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. Oh, lovely incisive pass. And we're focusing on a player who just... And he's made headway! Well, he stumped it out of there without much fuss. And the use of technology here to verify the fact that it didn't cross the line. Well, I didn't think he was close first time round, Derek, and quite rightly see here, nowhere near, but we might as well have another look. Not a goal, though. As clear as day. Tom Davis. They're certainly allowing their opponents to come on to them. Oh, great defending. Well, I believe there's been a goal in the Liverpool game, Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Watford. 15 minutes played, 1-1. Thanks very much, as always, Alan. Rebier. It is to be a throw-in. Tom Davis. Bailey. Moise Keane. And a creative look about this. Oh, good strike! Oh, really close. Just failed to keep his attempt down.
Donny van der Beek. Well, that attempt was never going to trouble the scoreboard operator. Well, you taught as a youngster technique, technique, technique. He didn't have any there. Aurier. It's with Daron. Yerai. And they'll get ready for the throw in. A chance to whip it in. And it's Tom Davis. Well, they are to intercept. Martin Daron. Deli Ali now. There wasn't much in that offside decision. Could have been in business. Donny van der Beek. Kyle Walker Peters has it. Bailey. Moving the ball forward with purpose. He made it look simple, really. Son. It's with Stefan de Frey. Martin de Roon. Promising pass. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Wonderful chance. And a goal to give them the lead. They have their reward. 1-0 then. Van der Beek. Regained possession. And it's Tom Davis. And now Alan. Michel Lisson plays it back. Van der Beek. This could level it. And it is the equaliser. Parity now. And who's to say what's going to happen next? Well, here it is again. The through ball is perfectly timed. It causes havoc, but then there's still plenty to do from here. Under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he just about keeps him at bay and finishes with a plum. Great goal. Half time then here in the English capital. And a creative look about this. So here we go, into the second half at the home of Tottenham Hotspur. Alan. Here is Digne. Bailey. It's now with Van der Beek. So a goal kick is what's coming up here. Over the touchline for a throw in. Options in the centre. Walker Peters. It's now with Van der Beek. And successfully cut out. Transfer news concerning Borussia Dortmund. They've hit the target on this one, I think, Lee. Well, Derek, the fans are really going to love him. He's a top player, a real pro. In fact, he's a manager's dream. Aurier. Now, let's see what they can do here. Martin Daron. And Hoybier with it. No foul. Spurs advantage. Can they forge ahead? Well, he did his job defensively. A real opening now. Richard is on. And a goal here. There it is. They've done it. Well, here it is again. It's all about the pace in transition. They were so quick to get out from the back. And he chooses to use power in the finish. Not much chance for the keeper when it's hit that hard. So the ball is rolling again. That should shake up Spurs a bit.
Martin Daron. It's with Bergwijn. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. Carabao Cup excitement to look forward to live here on EA TV. It's Spurs facing West Bromwich Albion. Well, a super atmosphere of cup football rarely lets you down. Exciting game that'll be, I'm sure, Derek. Richarlison. Almost unbelievably, he's kept it out. Well, I'm not sure how he's reached that. Just look at the stretch on that. A brilliant save. And he's fired over the corner. Now getting a strong fist on the ball. Crossed into the penalty area. And he clears the danger. Steven Bergwijn. Now Aurier. Really nice ball. Oh, just mistimed his run. And the flag going up. And a change for Spurs at this juncture. Walker Peters. Van der Beek. And Bailey. Well, it didn't happen for them in attack. And news of a goal at Anfield. Here's Alan McAnally. It's a second goal for Liverpool. It's been scored by Roberto Firmino. He beat the keeper for pace at his near post with a clinical strike. Ten minutes remain. 2-1. Thanks, Alan. Just a quick reminder, we'll have action from the Carabao Cup coming up live here on EA TV. It's Everton facing Manchester United. Knockout football, Derek, you know it's my favourite. Properly focuses the mind, that does. Well, it should do anyway. I'm looking forward to it. And it's a case of just five minutes left. Oh, he's given the ball away. Wow, just feel the energy from these Tottenham supporters. Can they use their team back into this game? Well, getting it forward, but they need an equaliser. Deli Alley making use of his physical strength to hang on to it. That's how to rob them of possession. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Dinia. Could be. Chance maybe. Oh, it's gone in. And you have to feel for him now. It will go down as an own goal. Well, let's see that again. I don't want to look at it as a former defender. I've scored a few of these in my time, and they were always my fault. Got blamed for all of them. Important the players pick him up from here on in. And it's full time here, and the big story is this. A win for Everson. Lee, what did you make of it? Well, Derek, with a defence like they've got, the forwards should be chomping at the bit in every game. They did the business today, and all in all, a really solid team effort. Well done. Creative look about this. Oh, good strike! Oh, really close, just failed to keep his attempt down. Some questions regarding the match. Thanks so much.